All right. You going to talk? Or are we going to have to make you talk? Uh, give it a rest, Cole. Aoi, I want you to take a deep breath, then tell us exactly what happened. No need to rush. Go as slow as you'd like. Okay. When Cannon appeared during our scuffle, Boss gave the order to retreat. All hands! Run and find someplace safe! And I mean now! We'll meet up in the station plaza in one hour! So run as fast as you can! We'll try to hold him off. Buy you some time. So hurry up and get out of here! <laughs> Akari! Aoi! You need to get the safety! Now! But... That's an order! Go! Uh, okay. Nice work, number one. Good grace under pressure there. Try not to hurt yourself, boss. He's got some tricks, but he's only one guy. We ain't gonna lose. Not if I have anything to say about it. So they took on Cannon by themselves? They were fighting so hard for us. That's how I managed to find an opening and run to safety. But aside from me, the only two people who showed up at the plaza after an hour passed were Boss and Mini Boss. By the time they were able to break away, they said everyone else was already gone. So what about Saki and Akari? Boss and Mini Boss are searching for them, but we still don't know where they are. I don't know if their search will do much good. They're both pretty beat up. Which is why you're about to ask me to go save them. Please, Asahi, find them. Look, Aoi... What will you do? One of them is your friend, right? Not as far as I'm concerned. I have no stake in this. But... It's just a traitor and some freedom fighter trash. I don't give a damn what happens to them. But I do want to get retribution against that pink-caped bastard. And if he's the one who kidnapped those two dumbasses, he's probably the one who tossed me back into my delusion, too. Which means I want to stain my hands with his blood! You should just leave Cannon to the people specially trained to hunt him. You mean like the DAB agents? What exactly is the DAB anyway? What does it stand for and what do they do? I think it's about time you tell us what you know. <sighs> Some people have pasts they'd prefer not to talk about, you know. And it's getting a bit late. What say we resume this line of discussion tomorrow? But you'll work faster when you're not exhausted. You're all quite literally beat, are you not? Uh... <laughs> but... Don't worry, Aoi. I can take care of you tonight. There's a spare room in the back. You can stay there. The rest of you go home and get some sleep. We'll talk about rescuing the Freedom Fighters in the morning. Now go. Go, go, go! The Kimmy. Now then. I love one of the usual. Ray Ray, at least this once. Wouldn't you agree that honesty is the best policy? <laughs> Not for them. There's no need. I bet it would make your job a lot easier, though. <sighs> they may not look it, but those kids have good heads on their shoulders. I'll think about it. even recognize this place. Feels like I haven't been home in ages. Yeah. Aw, oh, cheer up, man. 
Okay, yeah, it's not gonna be that easy, is it? I miss her. Me too. I just can't figure out why she'd turn on us. There has to be some kind of mistake. That's just not Saki. You're saying you don't think she's actually with them? Of course not. She's not like that. The Saki I know would never get tangled up with those jerks. That's not her. No, I think it's her all right. But... I'm going to believe. Believe that she'll come back to us someday, even if she is a freedom fighter. Morning, folks. Uh, Asahi. You're late. If you don't care about rescuing the Freedom Fighters, why would you care if he's late or not? I don't care about rescuing the Freedom Fighters, but I've already told you what I do care about. Getting revenge on that pink-caked man. Yeah, I think I will tell you. Tell us what? About the DAB. The agents who are searching for the pink-caked man. Please do. The 14th Bureau at the Ministry of Health, Labor, and Ruling. The Delusory Administration Bureau, the DAB. The Ministry of Health, Labor, and Ruling? They're part of the government? Correct. Machinery of the state that exists within the ministry and, as the name implies, administers delusions. Machinery of the state? You can't be serious. Well, that sounds like a delusion all its own. Sure, think of it as a delusion if it helps you cope. But be sure to factor in the repeating day and the new delusions that have been encroaching before your very eyes. That's true. Now, if I may continue, naturally the general populace has stayed blissfully unaware of the DAB's existence, due in no small part to the highly specialized nature of their work. A bit over-specialized, if you ask me. When you say they administer delusions, do you mean they manage them? That's a good word for it, yes. They take delusions and manage them as national assets. You've seen it already, haven't you? The power that delusions hold to make the unreal become real? Only humans are permitted to wield that power. And we do. The reason mankind has been able to progress so rapidly is because we've harnessed the power of delusions. The bicycle, the car, the personal computer, those fancy music players, all have their roots in delusion. But this power isn't foolproof. It has its drawbacks. Some people are saved by delusions, and other people hurt by them. More or less, yes. Most people don't actually recognize a delusion when they see it, which is why the Delusory Administration Bureau was formed, to manage the delusions permeating the world around us. This is ridiculous. Then why haven't they shown themselves up until now? There's been an excess of delusions encroaching upon Akiba lately, hasn't there? They're looking for assets that they can manage for the state. So, if a delusion is too dangerous, they'll take it down. Even now. And all of this is just outside of the public eye. If a delusion causes no harm, then it's just not news. Even if it causes the world to repeat? It's not as uncommon as you'd think. You just haven't noticed it happening before. The world's actually repeated itself quite a few times at this point. Really? The matter's simply been resolved in the background, without your knowledge. This time, though, the situation's escalated enough to draw them out of the shadows and into the open. That situation being Delusion Contractor Cannon. <laughs> Believe it or not, delusers are a rare breed. Humans with strong delusion energy don't come along too often. But now we've got someone who can amplify the delusions of the common man. A subcontractor open for business. Meaning there's no cap on the spread of delusions. At which point, it would no longer even be possible to manage them, forcing the DAB to show themselves in public. In an effort to apprehend the delusion contractor canon, of course. And why do you know all this? I'm afraid that's the end of my story. What? You can't just end there. You've got people to rescue, don't you? In which case, you should find yourself getting awfully close to the truth. Meeting canon? That's all well and good, but we don't even know where to look for them. They're very likely inside a delusion scape, like the rest of you are. Isn't there one near here we haven't hit yet? Well, there is the main delusion. Then I'd suggest we get going. Ah, 
damn it. Ray Ray doesn't mean to be rude, I assure you. Who even is he? Someday, 